hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel today we are going to be dealing on the topic of how to create custom shapes in pixel lab and uh, custom shapes helps in creating awesome uh, shapes you can use it for logo designing you can use it for creating some awesome effects in your text so um, without further ado let me just start so the first shape i want to create we have to use the grid to align it and then we bring this down and then we, we take our radius up so we have a nice curved this thing outside so we are going to edit okay sorry we are going to copy and go back to edit and then take the radius back down so with the grid we just take this up and then take this half just half of the circle or half of the rectangle and then we have this shape so you just merge them just merge them and okay let me just keep this one and hide here so the second shape will be this one so just create a nice rectangle and take the radius up okay before that use the grid line to adjust your shape so make sure they are touching the grid lines make sure they're touching it perfectly so we have this just take it over to 30 take your radius to 30 then create another shape just copy edit so we'll just take this here and take the radius back to zero and take it up here then copy it okay copy it again and then edit and bring it down here so we have this but that's not all you can also go back to i'm bringing the rectangle let me use okay let me use this one and then align it also i want it to stop here so just a nice rectangle so press ok then rotate this i'm going to rotate this like this yes so and that will be a rotation of 90 degrees so take this and then adjust it here until it meets the other grid line i feel the thing is i feel it's too big so just reduce the size and then use the position to move it until it lines up perfectly and then we'll move it down a bit okay we have this so when i merge all of them <clears throat> and add color we have this awesome shape we have this shape and it's so cool so you can also head over to some effects you can go over to gradient and then just choose a light gradient I'll be using a light gradient here. Okay, let me take this lighter too. Okay. And then we can add some inner shadow to it. Increase the blur radius and make it dark. So we can change the offsets. And just make it a little bit reddish. okay you can also add emboss to it you can reduce and increase the intensity i'll just leave it at here and then let me increase the bevel size yeah i'll reduce the specular hardness and uh, increase the ambient light and then we have this so you can head over and add some text let me just see how to create custom shapes in pixel lab and then i'll change my font i'll use poppins medium so we can put this in here just reduce your text spacing and the line spacing also so reduce this and reduce this so. give 
this is nice so we have something like this so you can also merge both of them and do something unique so creating custom shapes is very very easy i'll run to another one this one will be created using the circle so this one and then copy and edit it and drag this down a bit okay sorry i'll just align it to the center and then scale it up a bit so then let me see okay this is not what i had in mind actually so i'll just delete that and then i'll use a i'll use another shape to do it let me try using this shape okay and i'll rotate this nice so we just merge this and then add the color to it and then we have this this bubble icon so you can copy it and then just scale it and then rotate it like this so there's actually many stuff you can do with shapes creating custom shapes just like adobe illustrator so it really isn't complex so we have this so but that will be the end of the tutorial i hope you learned something i hope it was useful so if this video was useful just leave a like and uh, subscribe to this channel if you haven't and also share this video to your friends so that they can also learn and participate thank you for sticking to the end